Today, the Clark County Commission is meeting about the CDC's new guidance on masks. Now, this comes after the CDC said vaccinated Americans do not need to wear masks in most places. Now, this morning, the commission will discuss how the county plans to respond. So masking up while sitting in class. Advocates say it's time to ditch the face mask in school. They plan to list their reasons for the Clark County Commission today. We have 13 Action News reporter Sean Delancey joining us live right now outside of Commission Chambers with more on their plea. And Sean, this is coming just days before the school year ends. That's right, Dave and Colina. Although the school year does end next week, a group of parents and health advocates have petitioned the Clark County School Board to drop the mask mandate without success. So they are turning to the county commission. Health prof uh, mental health professional Bonnie Taylor is one of a handful of people planning to speak today. She cites relatively low coronavirus transmission rates among kids and a high recovery rate as reasons students should be allowed to go maskless. Taylor says her advocacy won't stop until kids can experience normal socialization for the first time in more than a year. They stand back. They don't know what to do. They don't make eye contact. They don't make conversation. It's bad. I, we want them to know we're not going to be quiet until they do the right thing. That's all there is to it. The CDC says that it is not time yet to go maskless in schools, at least not yet. They say that kids under 12 still can't get vaccinated, and many kids who are eligible to get the shot have not completed their vaccine cycle. The CDC says that they plan to update their advice and guidance on schools in the next couple of weeks, and we will bring you in any update that comes out of the county commission meeting. That begins at 9 o'clock this morning. Sean Delancey, 13 Action News.